The wire in this problem is bent into a right angle. It carries a current I of 28 amps, and we're asked to consider two current elements, each 2 millimeters in length, and each the same distance of 3 millimeters from the bend. I'll call them DL1 and DL2. Their directions are in the direction of the current. So this value D is 3 millimeters, and the magnitude of each current element is 2 millimeters. We're asked to find the magnetic field produced by them at a point midway along the line joining the two current elements. So that's located here, where this distance r is the same for each of them. The net magnetic field at that point in the middle is the vector sum of the field produced by current element 1 and current element 2. Each of those magnetic fields are given by the Bio Savart law. I'll write that here. In this expression, the vector r hat is the unit vector from each current element toward the field point. So r hat 1 looks like this, and r hat 2 looks like this. We can use the right hand rule to see that the magnetic field from each current element is directed into the screen at the field point. So we know the net field will be into the screen, and now we just need the magnitude. The magnitude of the Biot Savart law is written here where the angle phi is the angle between the current element and the r hat vector. Phi 1 is this angle, and because dl2 is directed to the right along the current, this angle is phi 2. From the geometry, we see that phi 1 is 45 degrees, and phi 2 works out to 135 degrees. We can evaluate the square of the distance between the current element and the field point. By looking at this right triangle, there are two equal sides, and we need the square of the hypotenuse. Each side is half of the distance d, so r squared works out to twice d over 2 squared, which is 4.5 times 10 to the minus 4 square meters. Because the field produced by each current element is in the same direction, we can find the net magnitude by just adding the two magnitudes. Realizing that sine of phi 1 equals sine of phi 2, we can simplify this before substituting the values. Mu naught over 4 pi is 1 times 10 to the minus 7 tesla meter per amp. Substitute the value for the current, the length of the current element, sine of 45 degrees, and then divide by r squared to find that the magnitude of the net field is 1.76 times 10 to the minus 5 tesla. We know from the right-hand rule that its direction is into the screen.